I want to talk today about ignoring advice from other people when it comes to finding happiness. So whether it's a particular psychological technique, an approach that people tell you to try, whether it's a spiritual path people are telling you to adopt. What I want to say here is not which one to do, because I'm not going to advocate anything. What I'm going to advocate is how to know what to avoid, because that's a help, or maybe an attitude that you should avoid. And that is when you're seeking for something, an approach and a technique or a philosophy or spirituality, whatever it is, avoid anyone who is certain, who has it all figured out, all right? Because what you want to find is your own certainty. If, if someone has found their truth and they're trying to tell you that this is the way, that's fine, but that's not real for you. So their advice, generally speaking, is coming from a good place. It's, they want to help, right? But what I'm saying is you have to test everything for yourself. It's no matter what it is, any kind of approach. If it doesn't work for you, it doesn't work for you. If a spiritual course doesn't work for you, it doesn't work for you. If a spiritual teacher, a therapist, if they don't work for you, they don't work for you. So it's about finding what does work for you. So avoid anyone who is certain, or at the very least, treat them with some skepticism, some healthy skepticism. Because while they're certain, they've found their path, but it's up to you to test everything, to bring a healthy skepticism into it. And if you notice that they're certain, just because they're certain does not mean you have to go along with whatever it is that they're saying. You have to find that certainty for yourself. And you're capable of doing that, you know, but there's plenty of people out there who are certain, not just a few people, or not the people that you happen to come into contact with. And if you tie yourself to something that you're not certain about, you'll find someone else who is certain and they'll bring you off in a different path anyway. So it's about finding your own truth, your own reality. And I'm not saying there is no objective truth out there. What I'm saying is it's your responsibility, it's your purpose to find whatever it is for yourself not to listen to someone else who's certain. Bear in mind, hope it helps. And that's what this video is designed to do. It's not to confuse you any further. It's to liberate you from feeling like you're stuck and you don't know where to go. It's about figuring things out for yourself. So hope it helps and I'll talk to you soon.